Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Boobins channel. I have Ann Amelia here, and um, if you've seen my previous video about the weekly diaper bag, I'd love to change her into one of those outfits that were put into that diaper bag. So, And today the weather is a bit cooler out, however, it's still hot out. The sun is shining so bright and um, I'm going, I have a, a different diaper. This is a lot bigger than the ones that I've shown for the diaper bag because I realized like her cloth body is old fashioned and it's very like big so which i have a question once i show you the body can we i gotta that thing has how can i do this oh and amelia i don't want to wake you up you're sleeping so peacefully <laughs> but she has her original cloth body and it's old fashioned is from 2012 I purchased her from eBay and she was my first and last purchase well no I shouldn't say last my second purchase from the states and both times were so expensive for me as a northern canadian that i only buy dolls within canada now but here is her original and it's signed the ocean number eight by michelle fagan 2011 oh i thought it was 2012 2011 I bought her second hand. She does come with the COA. Um, I did trade her one time with Erin, Candy Rose Sparkles. She's within Canada. I've I've done a lot of trades and bought from her a lot. And when she was reselling her, I totally said, Erin, I would love to buy her back or trade for her to get her back. So Aaron put new eyelashes in and I opened her mouth. She actually, and Amelia had, like, couldn't open her mouth and I actually opened it. And because of the slitting, I didn't want more breakage. So I put silicone and it kind of resembles jewel, which is fine with me. But I do have the powder here. So, because she's starting to get a little shiny. Now, she is considered the dragon skin, which is Ecoflex 30. Like, years and years ago, they called this silicone dragon skin. And it's actually very tough. Well, Ecoflex 30. The smaller number you are, the softer the silicone. But I'll show you. This is her original body, and it's definitely old-fashioned. But, so, there's nothing wrong with her old body. She is a little, I don't see, I don't know what's right here. I never opened her, and I don't think Erin opened her. Because Erin is also an artist. She's really good at alternative boards which I own quite a few of them which I love <laughs> but um I don't know if she ever opened her I had her as a boy as well I called him Beckett Silver 
but when I first had her as a girl, before I sold her, I her name was um, Amelia. But, and that was Anna Amelia. So this is just baby powder with cornstarch. I don't own any of the fancy any of the fancy silicone powders out there. Now I can also do this on her body. I used to like before we had Wonder Wafers. I used to actually put powder on their actual bodies like this, even the brown bodies. And it doesn't stain. I've said this before, but um, people will claim that it stains, but it doesn't stain. You just got to work it, like, beat it. <laughs> beat it out, work it out. It doesn't stain. And she's still in really, really good condition, like, considering how old she is. Erin and I have both taking very good care of her but yeah I sold her I can't remember if I sold her or traded her I probably traded because we normally do that more often than buying I did have her up for sale a few times this gorgeous one but not in a while she still seems shiny. But would you guys keep her original body or would you upgrade to a newer body? I also like her body because it's actually signed by Michelle Fagan, which is really cool. Maybe I'll just keep this diaper on her so I won't use. Oh to do her arms Ooh, it's a bit much that's okay I love the smell I love baby powder yeah there's absolutely nothing wrong with her except for like around her mouth because I've opened it and I had to like make sure that it wouldn't rip anymore I put silicone but I kind of like the jewel the fact it's not everyone's cup of tea but she is so cute I can't get over it she's extremely cute now I'm just overdoing it with the powder but that's a good thing about this silicone like being Ecofex 30 is like harder and I feel more like I don't have, I mean, of course I have to be delicate with her, but not as delicate because I can barely, oh, that feels weird. <laughs> feels kind of real because you know how we have bones, like how we feel, that's how she feels. <laughs> I won't bother doing her face. Because I want to move on. It's starting to get hot in here. But the outfit that I have chosen from that diaper bag is this beautiful dress. Actually, it looks like a romp. Look at this. It's a romper dress. This is underneath. If you can see that. Cool. Buttons on the back. I live on the busiest street of my town, so, and the windows are open, so you probably hear traffic. Oh, she's so cute. I love it. I love how cute she is. Okay, this romper is... Too many ruffles, I can't tell what I'm doing here. <laughs> I never had a daughter. 
I've always wanted one. I would totally would have bought this dress for her if she was real. So pretty and cute. Oh my goodness, Aunt Amelia. Good girl. Let's see if I can grab. Oh, this color looks so cute on her. First, I do love this color. This is like my favorite color, this light baby pink. Always love this. Always love this color. I had a, when I was really young, a toddler, I had this stuffed animal and I thought for sure it was a type of poodle, but it was actually a hippopotamus. As I grew older, I realized it was a hippopotamus, but I thought it was a puppy and it was this color and I loved her. I want this rump kind of up. Ah, No. She has a little bald spot. But she, she's still so cute. Let's fix up this. Do up the back of her dress. Put a tag on the inside. Let's see where are these. So guys, some of you may have known if you follow my Instagram, I ended a term position at teaching. I'm a teacher. And the term is over now. And I haven't found anything for the fall. So I'm kind of nervous about that. Excuse me. Oh, she looks so sweet. <laughs> Aww. She's got a big body here. I think this dress is like... Oh, she's so sweet. I didn't bring her brush over, though. She has curly hair right now, so I gotta fix the back a bit. But, oh, she's so cute. I think it's like a three or six month dress. Now, now she has shoes. Now I'm not sure if these will fit her. They might be big. Maybe she wears socks. Maybe I can put them on without undoing them. <laughs> I'm so awkward. <laughs> I'm laughing. I might have to undo this one. I think I never put on did you put on shoes before. It's funny. We're a little big on her. This is look like on camera. Yeah, a little big on her. This is her pacifier. Let's see, I don't want to bump the tripod like I normally sometimes do. Now, yeah, <laughs> let's see what the time is. Some silicone people put on like, I don't know what they call it, lube or something, a lubricant. Of some sort. We know it's what. <laughs> but I mean, if we powder up their bodies. And powder works just as easily like butter. It really works. Now, thing is, I don't know if her mouth will be. I did open her mouth. And I tried to make it wide enough. Let's see if she can. 
be wide enough to... Chris, I know, even though I did open her mouth, I didn't really put, keep anything in there for too long. Aww. Barely fits in there, I can't even throw it. So, I probably wouldn't want to keep it there for too long. Oh, she's still so sweet, though. I would, I would keep this in long enough for pictures, but she looks so sweet. Aw. So, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Oh, I almost forgot her hairband. Put the powder away. I forgot I did pick this one out. Let's see. It's kind of far away from me. Let's see how this does on her. Oops. <laughs> Thank goodness she's not real. I feel really bad for smacking her head around. Aww. I think I'm just... I don't know. I'm being a perfectionist. I want this turn. <laughs> I can't just turn it because it's really in her. Just like a leg. The powder I put on her, on this, is in her mouth now. Aww. <laughs> She is so sweet here. Put her up close. Or wait, maybe I can lure you. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh, so cute, Anna Amelia. I don't know, let's see. Take that out. Oh. She looks like up close. Erin did a wonderful job. And her nose isn't open or anything. It's just deep. But Erin did a really good job on her eyelashes. And now I kind of messed up her mouth by opening it, but I think it's cute. I think the drool look is sweet. Aww. So what would you guys do? Would you keep her original body or would you give her a new one? Oh, she's so sweet. Look at that. <laughs> cute. So, this guys, thank you so much for watching, and I hope that you're having a great day. I love that you are here. I've been getting comments from a few people that always comment on my videos. Uh, Donalda, thank you so much for your tip. Uh, sh the video where I showed the diaper bag, and I thought it was like a, uh, what are they called, a changing pad. But she mentioned that I should use it as a liner in the bassinet. So I thought, oh, yeah, that's a really good idea. So thank you so much for all your support. There's a few ladies that always comment on my videos. I really, really appreciate it. And Alice, I loved that you emailed me. Thank you so much. I love it all. You guys, you make me feel so appreciated and makes me want to do more videos for you guys. So any requests any comments down below um i love it all thank you so much you guys so much hands still love you guys match hand guys waving bye bye guys until next time i love you guys thank you so much for everything hope that your day is going well mine is going very well <laughs> bye guys